Yo, 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 what's good? It's Skinny the Don on the Skinny SRT channel, man. Call me everything but broke. If you're picking up what I'm putting down, hit the subscribe button and stick around. Today, this video is sponsored by Mo Bubs. They sent me something to show y'all, man. Installation. A uh, little installation video for y'all. But today, man, it's just the day in the life of a Hellcat owner, you know. Um, go to the car wash, fill her up with gas, uh, do some pulls, do some digs. You already know how that is. Rap the all tad about the situation of Mopar and where it's going and uh, what I think my next car is going to be. So, hey, ride with me, man. Got to start it off with this here epic cold start. The loudest cold start in the world, bro. Let's get it, man. What a beautiful car. What a beautiful car. And it's not just because it's mine, people. Make sure you subscribe up to the channel, man. Get yourself a Hellcat. Get yourself a Hellcat. Now let's go get this here bad boy filled up, man, with that 93 Octane. You feel me? Before we do that, this here video is sponsored by Mobub, Mobub. Uh, basically, let me show you what happened. When you have kids, like this here stuff happens, stuff just gets missing. As you can see, um, I did the little mods on the knobs right here, right? You see that one is missing on the air conditioning knob. So Mobub's reached out to me. Now, they sent me this and uh, it's usually like for the Jeep products, like for the Durango's and stuff like that. But they sent me Three rings, three rings. So we're going to show how to put this here on simple and see if it fits. So see if it fits for the Dodge Challenger Hellcat SRT. So let's check it out. This is a real cheap, inexpensive mod. You can find them on Amazon. I'm going to link them in the description. So um, let's see if it works. As you can see what I'm working with right here. So let's check it out. People with Durango's, uh, this here is how it's coming. Uh, these here three big wide um, knobs, interior trim knob for the climate control. Like I said, mine's missing the climate control, but these here are noticeably way smaller than these. Like you can see that, right? So like it's just going on this one right here. So check it out. Take it out the bag and just. It just goes on just like that. Just like that, ladies and gentlemen. Just like that. So, if you a Dodge or a Jeep owner, tap in with Mobub, man. Get you some accessories. Mod your car up. Boss your life up. Skinny SRT approved. Tell them Skinny the Don sent you. Yeah. Time to hit the gas station, man. Gotta cut the stars on. Stars on in the daytime. Get my custom settings right. Get my custom settings right. As you can see, got enough gas to get to the gas station. Let me show you the custom settings. Got it right in my custom mode. Hello. Hell. So people are always asking me all the time, man, what kind of gas do I put in the skin cap? Let me show you. Nothing but Shell V-Power Nitro 93 Octane. That's it. Let's fill her up. Thank you. 
323. Back on cold. Filled up. Let's get it. 717. Come on, pimp. You see this here big horn ram? This big horn ram? Almost hit my Hellcat. Yeah, this big horn ram. Almost hit my Hellcat, man. Shoot. I don't know what's wrong with it. I don't know what's wrong with this here big horn ram. 1500. But subscribe to the channel. Man, the number one question, man, everybody always asks when they see me, man, yo, how much do it cost to drive a Hellcat, bro? And I'd be like, man, listen, man, you got to have 100, 200, 300, 400, 500, 600, 700, 800, 900, a band, 100, 200, 300, 400. But it don't cost me shit because mine's paid for. <laughs> I like that. Appreciate it, man. Appreciate it. Black life. <laughs> Before I hit the car wash, had the Best Buy man and get gave a TV. Out on his bunk bed, messed around and took out his last TV. It wasn't his fault, so go grab him one. He done became a Fortnite king, so it is what it is. Take y'all with me. Go vlog. Hit the car wash and then that's it. We done got gas. Lexus LS four and a half. Almost hit my Hellcat. Yeah, this Lexus LS four and a half. Almost hit my Hellcat. Look, barely can walk through here. I don't know why it's parked this close. Hey. I don't know. These here gaming computers right here. See a wide monitor. Well, got that out the way, so now on to the car wash. Pulling up at the sick car wash. The homies be like, man, why you always going to the uh, take five car wash, bro? Why don't you let me wash your car? I'm like, man. Letting y'all wash my car, bro. Like, I got a wrap on here, bro. I got a wrap on here. It's not that serious. If I didn't have a wrap on here, obviously, I would not be going to a car wash like this because I'd be worrying about it swirling the paint or chipping off some paint or something like that. But, man, I don't care nothing about that, man. I got a wrap, bro. That's why I got it wrapped, man, to protect the paint job. Before y'all get in the comments and be like, yo, we taking this Hellcat, man. Do take five car wash. Man, listen, bro. Get you a Hellcat and you can do whatever it is you want to do with it. You feel me? 
got my air freshening, and I can come through here three, four, five times a day if I want, man. Not that piling off. So let's get it. Just like that. Now pull up to this here vacuum cleaner, go get the spray for the windshield and the interior, and then I'm out. Y'all be the judge, man. $30 a month membership, man. Wash your car as many times as you want to, man. Thank me later. Now I'm about to go to Lowe's, grab me a growler, and then shoot. That's it, bro. Down here at Lowe's, man. Got my growler. Go refill up on that uh, homegrown beer. And, uh... Get ready to end this here day. A turtle cheesecake. It's gonna have a chocolate caramel. Turtle cheesecake. Yep. Pretty good. I don't know if the 64s have. Yeah. They, they both are? They're supposed to be there. It's only the side of the So those are half Oh, those are half price. Yeah. Man, you came out the wrong day. Yeah, I can't Saturday do it. Saturday is the day to get, a, get some jugs. <laughs> yeah, I'll be through. I'll be back through Saturday. Yeah, How I'll long be... does it stay good like that, though? I don't even keep it long enough. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I hear yeah, you. that'll be gone probably tonight or um, yeah. by tomorrow. No, I, I hear you. See, I used to, before I got those, I would get the can. But then I was like, oh. Well, how, the can's like 20 ounces. I think the can is the same, right? The can is the same as the small one. It's just disposable. Yeah. But you couldn't, like, get a refill, so I was like, oh. Hmm. Learn more and more. <laughs> can't be the grocery store where you can drink. Yeah. <laughs> I'm getting them to get king crab legs in this place. Okay. They, uh, and, you know, so they... So where they gonna get them from? Oh, they, they come in frozen. They come in frozen. Oh, they're not yeah, like... No, everybody... Uh, well, anything in South Carolina is gonna be frozen. It's, okay, okay. But you can never get it at this Lowe's. So, like, they'll run them on sale. But, you know, I picked them up... Sunday here. I picked up five pounds. Here? Yeah. Yeah, they don't have any more. Oh. I, that's why I actually came in to get some more. Oh. And I talked to the manager here, and the other store picked up. They had, they picked up. A, they had a ca another case, and the other store took it. And okay. And they're sold out. But back in there, they was always saying, "Oh, people on the cheap and won't buy crap king crab legs." It's like, are you kidding? That's me? a lie. Yeah, <laughs> no, you can't be. You just put it out. I mean, I see they got, I see they got tomahawk steaks over there too. 
Oh, oh my God, those are awesome too. I've, I've been buying them. They, they'll run them on sale. Uh -huh. uh, I'm trying to think of what the price is. It's like fifteen dollars a pound. Yeah, I feel like maybe about run. twenty, maybe. They're twenty, I think, normal. Okay, but, but then they'll, they'll run them on sale for like fifteen. And I've I've ate a lot of their tomahawks. Maybe you like grill them. Uh, That's how I do it. I'll I'll take it out there and I'll uh, I'll bake and grill. So like you bake it and it didn't it takes about no, not even an hour. You bake, them big, first. I guess. you bake them first. Uh -huh. and then you, you then grill, you sear them. You sear. You see. Well, no, no. You you do, you, grill, you grill it and then you keep baking. And then you eat it. Okay. But what you do? It, medium. I do medium rare. Okay. Hey, you too. All right. You you do. I, I do a medium rare, but I tell you what, they came out so damn good. Like, how? It came out. It came out better than what you can get because I bought them on Main Street at that uh, all that restaurant in the corner there. That they got steakhouse. Okay. On, on Main. You bought one out of there. Well, yeah. Well, you well, buy Oh, you bought it. That was a restaurant. Yeah, okay. They, but you know, it's like seventy seventy dollars at a la carte. Oh yeah, yeah. Good talking to you, man. Good talking. To you. This is by far the best place to get beer at, bro. Look at all this here beer. Carolina beer. So the camera died, man, while I was in there, but there you have it, man. Just a day in the life, man, of a Hellcat rider. Hopefully y'all enjoyed this here vlog. I don't even know, man. I don't even know. I came and I conquered the Hellcat game. Nobody can say that they had a Hellcat better than mine. Not a Hellcat, like, built from the ground up, stock. You might have some super stocks that's better than mine. A demon that's better than mine, but not no SRT Hellcat Challenger, bro. You might even have a Charger that's better than mine, but not a Challenger. Not a Challenger, man. Let me know. What do y'all want to see me do next, man? Uh, it's summertime. Do you want me to start the videos up where I let, uh, content creators try the Hellcat see what they think do y'all want me to get those popping again um, do you want me to get the pull up videos popping again or what just let me know man just let me know but uh thanks for your time I'm actually before I go actually thinking about getting the Hellcat Durango that's what I was actually thinking about getting Get in the comments and let me know what you think about that. It was either gonna be get the Hellcat Durango or get me a Super Stop. One of the two, so. It is what it is, man. It is what it is. Small thing to a giant. As long as you got the money to pay for it, you can get whatever it is, man, you want. And remember, believe in yourself. I hear a lot of people saying, yo, that's my dream car, man. Yo, you so lucky. Nah, don't think like
like that. Because the same way somebody else can get it, you can get it. The same way somebody else can get it, you can get it. But um, I appreciate you allowing me the opportunity to entertain y'all on this here vlog. Thanks for your time. Time is one thing you can't get back. And you chose to spend it riding out with me. Appreciate that. Um, and yeah.